So today is going to be uh, slightly shorter than yesterday, so it gives everyone kind of a little bit of time to maybe fly back home or just have some more kind of intimate conversations after the conference. So what we're going to have today, um, starting in just a minute or two, is going to be our second panel. So this is going to be what are the attributes of being able to work with other hardware providers. So for example, legal agreements, interfaces, and integration and that kind of thing. And so this sort of today's focus is gonna be more on kind of the logistics of Lunar Proving Grounds. So how logistically we can make this work. Whereas yesterday was a little bit more focused on what do the Lunar Proving Grounds need? What are the, the very specific details of what needs to be included in them? So that's kind of the, the transition there. So we've talked about that yesterday and today is more about, okay, now we know sort of what we need and sort of what needs to be included in LPGs, but now how do we actually do it? Um, so that's gonna go until 11.45, which will be lunch. So we're gonna have an earlier lunch today just to kind of shift things up. But again, 90 minutes for lunch uh, gives you all an opportunity to um, check out the restaurants that are across Montpellier Road. Uh, you can also go to the Building One cafeteria, which has a lot of great options. Uh, and then starting in the afternoon, we're going to do open discussion two. So this is going to be an open discussion, just like yesterday, that sort of, you know, uh, is inspired by the conversations from the morning panel. So the open discussion two, given those attributes that we talked about in panel two uh, that are going to be needed for, for working with other hardware providers, what are the logistical characteristics that technology developers desire in an LPG? Uh, and so that is the part of the session where you're going to kind of go out into your little breakout groups. You had a number when you signed in. Hopefully, if you did not stop at the check-in tables when you arrived this morning, please do at some point before lunch uh, or what, okay, before the open discussion. You'll, you'll get another number. So yesterday you had a breakout number. Let's say it was four, or seven, ten, whatever you had. Um, today you are going to get a completely different number, so this is just kind of like switch things up and like scatter people, diversify things. Um, online, I believe, we'll have a similar thing that will be randomized into a series of breakout groups online, uh, and you'll have a different set of questions uh, to kind of tackle today. Uh, and then in the afternoon we'll have sort of an hour of takeaways and next steps, so Dave Smith and Jibu Abraham are going to sort of help us through that a little bit. So that's going to be kind of culminating everything, summarizing what we talked about, and then really working on path forward, next steps. What do we actually do with this information? How do we make this an actionable workshop? So I think that's all the things I wanted to say. So I think we can go ahead and hand it over to Kristen Jaburik, who is the panel moderator. And we've got quite a few panelists online too, so hopefully we'll be able to see their faces when they pop up. But go ahead, Kristen. 